Hey guys, welcome to Evidential Tech. My name is Evidence. In this video, I am going to show you three ways to create titles in Adobe Premiere Pro. So the first way is the simplest way possible. Just come over here to this two box here and click on titles. Do an assist to type two. And just click on your video and type in the title. And as you can see, as you do that here, um, this thing appears right here and you can move this to anywhere you want on the video and you can go back here and you can extend this you can extend this to make it as long or as short as you want it to be and when you double click on this and come over to the effect controls bar on the left side you'll be able to control how this title looks you'll be able to change um, the stroke the color the shadow be able to change um, the text form like the text format and everything all the way all from the effect controls bar and you can change um, also the rotation where you want it to be on the screen you can see if you want it to be big or small you can change um, if you want it to be rotated anyhow you want it to be so that's the easiest way to create titles in Adobe Premiere Pro this is the second way to create titles in Adobe Premiere Pro is come over here and click on this window and go to File, New, Legacy Title, and let's call this um, Title 9. And you can change this if you want to or just leave it as it is. And this settings here match your current video settings. So you can change this if you want to or leave it. And you click OK. And this right here comes up and whatever image was on here will show up here if you do not want this image come over here to click and click background and choose the color of your background let me say red for example and click OK and if you do want this image to appear then um, uncheck this box so if you have this box checked here whenever you place the title on here um, instead of having the picture on the, or the video you will have this background instead but we want to have the video itself as the background so I'm going to uncheck this box and from here you see the type tool also you can type type vertically or um, you can just do a type tool or you can create a text box so I'm just going to click on this um, type tool and click whatever I want and type what I want and once you do that you can come over to this arrow selection tool and click on it and highlight this and you can change different things about it so I want the text to be red for example and you can change if you want the text to be filled or not filled you can from here you can choose if you want the text to have inner strokes and outer strokes if you want the text to have a shadow let's say I want it to have a shadow of green and click OK and you can change different properties of the text from here and once you are finished and with whatever modifications you want you can just close this out and if you come over here you see title 09 and you just drag it to whatever you want on the video and you can also extend this as you want it to be as long or as little as you want it to be and when you double click on this this legacy title will come up and from here you can make any modifications you want to do and from here if you want the title to roll in and roll out this is how you do it from this thing right here you can choose if the title just appears and disappears um, when this is over or if you want it to roll in or crawl left and stuff like that let's say you want it to roll and you want it to start off screen and end off screen and just click ok when we come back um, to this and play this video forward, you see that the text will roll in and roll out. Let me make this shorter. As you can see, text is rolling in and out of the video. That is the second way to create titles in Adobe Premiere Pro. The third way to create a titles in Adobe Premiere Pro is using um, essential graphics. So if you come over here to the graphics tab up here, when you click on it, this comes up here and make sure you are in essential graphic and not libraries. And you see where it says captions and subtitles. You see where it says titles. 
double click on it and there's different preset titles for you to choose from and let's say i choose this one you just drag it onto your timeline and let me just leave this and click ok and when you double click on this um, template here you see everything up here and I'm going to show you what it looks like that is what it looks like so you can add more things to this or you can leave it as it is and to edit the text itself you can just click on this text and you see many different options for you to choose from you can change um, the type of font it is you can change the color the appearance you can um, change the, be um, the be bevel you can um, change the rotation or anything like that you can make your change you can make whatever changes you want to this particular text on here or you can come over here to effect controls tab and make your changes over here so from here you can change you can click on each individual one and change um, the text the rotation how you want it to be what you, what you want it to look like you can change other stuff from here individually and if you want to make an overall change to the whole thing to everything you can do that from motion and whatever you do here ap applies to every single thing as opposed to applying to each individual thing after making your changes onto this particular one you can also make that change to this one and this one and this one without um, doing this all over again so first let's say for example after you have made your changes here and click ok and stuff like that you can save this preset you can come here and save it create a new preset and save it as text style one and click ok and then when you click on this you can come here and click text style one and whatever changes you made to this one will automatically be applied to this one all right guys that's it for today's video that is three ways you can create titles in adobe premiere pro if you like this video please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe for more videos like this one in the meantime i will see you on the next video bye